I'm Steve Hermitage. Now in this video I want to share with you the lighting setup that I used to light these lovely summer flowers. The image that I want to create is a well-lit flower on a pure white background and I'm using two Canon speed lights to achieve that result. Now I've got a 580 EX Mark II set up just there, you can just see it in the shot and that was used to give me my brilliant white background. Now, in between the 580EX and the flower, because my camera was here when I took the shot, I had this white uh, translucent perspex to diffuse that light to give me that brilliant white background. That 580EX is on manual mode, it's on full power and is set as the master unit. Now the 430EX is set as the slave unit, it's also on manual, it's also on full power. And Remember, these two talk to each other, so you can have this one um, move it around. Um, it doesn't have to be linked to the camera because you've linked that one to the camera using this cord. This one bounce off, bounces off the uh, reflector here to like the side of the flower. Now, in terms of the camera settings, I was on ISO 100, 1 200th of a second at f16, and that was a pretty good starting point uh, to take shots of the flowers. Now I was also using a 105mm macro lens and to give you some idea of the distances here, the distance between the 580EX2 and the translucent screen is around 35cm, between the screen and the subject is around 30cm and then between the subject and the camera was around 70 centimeters. So again, that is pretty useful information as a good starting point. Now remember, if you want to change the amount of light that hits the subject, you can play, of course, with the aperture, you can play with the ISO setting, you can play with the shutter speed. But don't forget that the intensity of light falls off when, in fact, it falls off, um, quite considerably as you move the light source from the subject. So if, you're, if your lighting isn't quite right, you don't have to change a camera setting. Remember, you also have the option of moving the light source. And sometimes that's a very quick way of remedying um, a, a lighting setup that isn't quite right. Well, you can get some fabulous shots of flowers this way. Good luck if you try this project.